A local teenager convicted of planning a school shooting will spend four years in prison. John Staley, also known as Jack, was 16 years old when he was overheard planning that mass shooting. It happened at Hillier Davidson High School back in October of 2016. Last month, he pleaded no contest to conspiracy to commit murder. The maximum sentence was 11 years. NBC 4's Rick Reitzel was at his sentencing where Staley apologized in court. 17-year-old John Staley apologized for his actions before being sentenced and asked Franklin County Common Pleas Judge David Kane for mercy. I would like to say that I'm gravely sorry for my actions. And I'm sorry to my friends, my family, and people I've affected with those actions. I never meant for this to go this far. And I'm sorry that I have to be in front of you today, this, this day, Your Honor. Please, please have mercy on me, sir. Judge Kane said probation wasn't enough, sending him to prison for four years, less than the 11-year maximum, after Staley pleaded no contest to conspiracy to murder others. Family members couldn't contain their emotions as they learned of his fate. He researched firearms. When it became difficult to get firearms, he researched parts of firearms so that he could assemble them at the school. During the attack or before the attack, he researched and traded around racist imagery. A teacher from an outside organization who worked with Staley in the juvenile detention center spoke highly about his progress. This would be a child that has been rehabilitated. I mean, I don't see any of that racist or violence or anger. His attorney says Staley wasn't planning to harm anyone, but prison will change him. You want to make this kid a racist? Send him to prison. You want to make this kid a criminal? Send him to prison. You want to make this kid dangerous? Send him to prison. Staley has already served 349 days in jail, which will be applied to his sentence. And once he's released, he'll have five years of community control. Local for you at the Franklin County Courthouse, Rick Reitzel, NBC4.